This is my ultimate 11 favorite characters and teammates of my career. My goalkeeper will be Lukas Fabianski, uh, one of my favorite teammates uh, because he's Polish. He lived close to the German border. And when I joined uh, Arsenal, he was very close to me uh, and uh, he saved a lot of penalties, especially in our FA Cup run when we won our first title, I can remember. And uh, we are very close because we are NBA favorites. We love the game and we love to compete at sh against each other on and off the field. He was someone who always vo motivated me and always kept me going. Thank you, Lucas. On the right side, I have a teammate I spent uh, five years together. We played in Bremen, is Clemens Fritz. And uh, we shared the hotel room. We are very close still. And that's why I pick him for the right back. He will chase players up and down. At center back, I pick uh, from the national team of Germany. We had a fruitful start in 2006 when we played together. So it's Christoph Metzelder. We played a huge part in uh, 2006 when we won bronze in Germany. And uh, we were very intelligent on and off the field. So I pick him so we could end up after our careers uh, doing some stuff together, especially in punditry, we will see. On the left center back side, I'll pick Jens Novotny. Surprise, surprise, because he was picked for the national team as well in 2006. And um, we had uh, one thing going on in our, f in our spare time. We played some World of Warcraft together. He was uh, 30 plus and I was very young and he helped me to switch off from the games and just focus on a virtual world. So thank you for that, Jens. Uh, on the left, I'll pick uh, a teammate of mine who is um, very pretty much underrated even now. It's Nacho Monreal because he's he's just brilliant uh, on and off the pitch, um, always with a smile, always that being a little bit on the edge of being late in everything he does. But when it counts, he's just there and, and delivers, especially this season, a lot of goals already. Um, Nacho, I'm very proud of your progress and uh, a lot of people don't see you. Uh, you deserve much more credit for what we achieve here at this club. I picked two defensive midfielders in Frank Baumann. We played together in Bremen. He was rock solid. He was our captain and that's why I learned a lot from him. How he, he was a very quiet leader and everything he does, he was a role model and everything he did on and off the pitch. Um, he was just brilliant to me and helped me progress in, helped me um, pretty much uh, on and off the field. So I pick him. And next to him is Mikel Arteta. Mikel Arteta and, and myself, we joined in 2011 in the crazy last week of the transfer window. We lost 8-2 to Man United and the manager decided to get uh, some new additions. Um, Mikel and I we were two of those. We spent a lot of time together in a hotel. We spent a lot of time together afterwards because we got on well with each other. Um, complimented each other on and off the field. It was brilliant to see him rising at Arsenal, then named captain after two seasons. On the right side, I've picked Thomas Rosicki because he's just, he's just a legend for me because um, I started in Hanover, he played for Dortmund. Um, he was just brilliant in the Bundesliga um, and then he, he was transferred to Arsenal, I think. Everyone recognized him as one of those greats this club deserves and he deserves a lot of credit. Got a little bit unlucky with his injuries, but he lights up every dressing room, every pitch. Uh, I think everyone at, at the club loves him for just being himself. On the left side of midfield, I pick Santi Gazzola. He is just a magician. We miss him very much. You could always rely on, you could always play the pass to him. He was always find a solution. Um, I wish him well for, for him, for his future. My strikers will be Lukas Podolski because he is one of those positive, crazy teammates. He was always in the same positive mood every single day 
and he has got that left foot that makes the difference. So I want to thank him for our time we spent together in the national team and at Arsenal. It was always a pleasure to play alongside him and uh, to be part of his little bubble, bubble of happiness. My second striker is Ivan Klasnic. We had a spell together in Bremen. Um, when I played against him, when I played for Hanover, I hated it because he was one of the best. He was one of those strikers who were always in the right spot and when you thought you got him, he always had cheeky moves, that little Croatian cheekiness. Um, he was always ahead of the game and his left foot was just brilliant. He had a um, little kidney disease now, got a lot of transplantation, so he had a little bit, he is a little bit unlucky in, in his life. But I wish him well and I pick him for, for one of my strikers in my Ultimate 11. For more videos, subscribe. <laughs>